Hey, what's going on? This is another episode of the Reporter Podcast Edition for the December the 1st, 2023. We're doing my <clears throat> second feel good, a good story of uh, of the, this doubleheader. Um, Jack Harlow continues to, uh, uh, I guess you say, continues to represent Louisville uh, real well. Um, I guess you'd say pretty much uh, uh, only really good, uh, straight good uh, rapper out, out there these days. <laughs> I ain't saying he's saved or nothing like that or perfect, but uh, <laughs> but uh, he's pretty much the uh, only good one uh, these days. Uh, in t- talking about giving back, yeah, he, he's a, he's, a, he's a plus when it comes to giving back to his uh, hometown of Louisville, Kentucky. I repeat, Louisville, Kentucky. <laughs> To plug my home t- uh, my hometown a little bit, <laughs> uh, but let's get right into it. Um, Jack Harlow surprises Louisville children, uh, children, adults with a thousand free New Balance sh- uh, Balance shoes. Story's kind of cold a little bit from November twenty eighth. Uh, uh, brought to you by WDRB dot com. Louisville, Kentucky, uh, a Louisville rapper surprised uh, children and adults with a 1,000 uh, New Balance shoes on Tuesday evening. Jack Harlow, a six-time Grammy-nominated artist, stopped at uh, at Metro United Way as part of his No Place Like Home concert series. New uh, Balance and, and uh, the Jack Harlow Foundation partnered before the event to the benefit children and adults at uh, May, uh, Murrayhurst uh, sowing seeds with uh, Faith St. John Center up uh, lo- up Louisville and Metro United Way. I've been uh, waiting to do this for a long time. I grew up wearing uh, New Balance in high school. I got picked on for wearing New Balance, Harlow said uh, to the crowd. I'm really proud uh, to be uh, able to do this with Metro United Way and my foundation. Dozens of children received new shoes and uh, met Harlow posing for po- photos at the event in downtown town Louisville. They wrote, uh, wrote handwritten uh, thank you notes uh, to Harlow to show their appreciation. Adria uh, Johnson, CEO of the Metro United Way, said Harlow wanted to support young people in Louisville, which led to the event. This was uh, kept uh, very quiet for a re- reason. We, we wanted to, uh, this to be a uh, surprise, Johnson said. He's a very humble person. I think that uh, plays out uh, on how he uh, wants to bless the community. Maggie Harlow, Jack's mother uh, and executive director of the Jack Harlow Foundation, said the largest giveaway uh, the foundation has done with with uh, New Balance. It was a short of uh, organic uh, result. It was short of an uh, organic result uh, because Jack loves New Balance. He has loved New Balance since he was a kid. Maggie Harlow said Jack had a big idea of a thousand shoe uh, giveaway and New Balance was all in. She said Harlow had uh, picked on picked the local organizations and would be uh, supported by the uh, giveaway. He always wanted to have uh, that part of his brand supporting his hometown, uh, Maggie Harlow said, and all from uh, his heart and all, all very uh, genuine. Although is uh, also collecting donations for local nonprofits while on uh, tour in Kentucky, although is visiting parts of uh, Kentucky for his third annual No Place Like Home tour. The Atherton High School graduate, I repeat, Atherton High School graduate, uh, my, my alma mater, class of '97, <laughs> uh, 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 is collecting donations uh, for. Uh, uh, local nonprofits, uh, f- with the help of Metro United Way during the tour, items uh, being collected included uh, deodorant, body wash, non-perishable foods, toilet paper, paper towels, rolls, and uh, children's pajamas. This isn't about me. This is about our city and organizations and in our community being able to come uh, together and to, and to do something special like this. Jack Carlo said uh, to the crowd, "Thank you for." Everyone in the uh, in here who uh, are uh, contributing to make this city a better place. So basically, uh, there's a guy giving back uh, straight out of Louisville, Jack Harlow. Uh, yeah, 
Cause I can say he's a, he's a rare breed because you uh, you rarely hear, rarely hear about uh, rappers like him coming back to the community and giving back. But uh, and then somehow the the very thing that kids piece of pick on him about, he flipped it and uh, made it uh, made it a uh, made it an empire pretty much. He pretty much got, he's pretty much advertised for New Balance. And we're in New Balance. The same thing the kids used to pick on them about. <laughs> Boy, if they only knew how he is now, that would make them uh, feel awfully uh, stupid. <laughs> <clears throat> and how uh, and how they uh, how they used to uh, if they only, uh, this was like if they, if they only could see them now wearing the same thing they used to pick on them uh, about uh, over. <laughs> Somehow things change, change around for the good. But uh, that's all I got for this one. Uh, this is another episode of The Reporter uh, uh, Podcast Edition for December 12th. Uh, no, no, December 1st, 2023. Y'all have a good one. I'm gone.